Good morning, guys. Happy Saturday morning. It's feeling real fall, y'all. We went out to dinner last night and we. <laughs> We both had a flannel on and they looked very similar, like the same size blocks. His was black, mine was really dark blue. Matchy, matchy. It just kind of happened that way and I'm not were you sure. Em were you embarrassed by it? I think maybe a little. <laughs> just a little. Oh, man. We, we sat in this like outdoor picnic table place and it was, so cute. it was the perfect weather the sunset and the we couldn't see the sunset but the sky was pink mm -hmm. it was pretty fun it was really fun what are your oh dear oh you don't want me She's to ask you a question me in the morning i thought we were having a little q a oh, go ahead. <laughs> what are your fall Goals like uh, we have fully arrived oh. at fall. What are some things you want to do? Well, but see, that wasn't that bad of a question. It, was, was it? it wasn't that bad. Um, I have had it in my mind that when it's 90 degrees out, okay, I kind of like vow to myself not to wear jeans or like a flannel, like a flannel because. It's not gonna be 90 degrees all year. And so I have been forcing myself to embrace the warmth, put on my shorts that have lemons on them, or my, you know, just put on shorts. Bright clothes. Yes, Summery and embrace things. the summer weather while it's here. I'm ready to wear flannels. I was glad to wear a flannel last night. Well, and it was chilly. Yeah, it was. You wore a sweater later on as well. What are your fall goals? Pumpkin pie. Yeah. <laughs> your pumpkin cookies. I was like, thinking about this. Mary made these pumpkin cookies that like, they have like addictive drugs in them. They are so good. They're It's the cream soft. cheese frosting. Well, the cookie itself is soft. Mm -hmm. Although I'm having trouble remembering them. They're soft and then the, the frosting on top Mm. I do not bake very much, but when I do, I'm going to make those cookies. I'm excited about that. I'm excited about, for me, fall, uh, like I love Thanksgiving foods. Yeah. So. Me too. I'm all about pumpkin pie, cranberry and turkey stuffing. All about that turkey, about that turkey. I'm like. Super excited to smoke another turkey and... I'm excited. Okay. Hold on. It made me... I got so excited I forgot to take a drink of coffee. <laughs> you're like, oh, I'm excited. I'm so excited. When you're done smoking the turkey and then we eat the turkey, the then I get a carcass. Broth. Turkey broth that lasts us a long time because that makes a lot of broth. Yeah, it's incredible. Yes. I've been doing it in the Instant Pot for the last maybe year or two. And it's really easy. I, I love it. I put it in the Instant Pot. Put the carcass, like the bones, right? Mm -hmm. And you can throw a half an onion and a carrot in there if you want to. Sometimes I do. Sometimes yeah. I don't. And um, I need to remember, I heard... You, could, you should put some vinegar in, like a tablespoon of vinegar. It helps pull the goodness out of the bones. That makes sense. Anyway, then I set it to high pressure for two hours and walk away. Amazing. And it makes really incredible broth, so. And when we use the carcass after smoking it, I feel like it has like this smoky flavor in the broth. Delicious. Yeah. Um, other goals, uh -huh. like, I just want to sit outside on cool evenings mm -hmm. and have the fire going. Oh yeah. Like, and watch the grass grow. <laughs> this is like, 
I don't know. Is this it's, the best time of the year? I don't know. There's just a lot of... I, I like I like this season. It's, especially, I loved Boston in the fall, but I like... I think we have a longer, like, 50 to 70 degree range time period here in North Carolina. So I and feel then, like that's just enjoyable to be outside in a flannel or right. a sweatshirt or... And then we have that temperature as well. Bless you. <laughs> when everybody's... Dead. When everybody's in the, the heart of winter, we're like, oh, it's actually like 50 degrees outside and pretty warm, so like, I might as well just go outside. Yeah. You know, and true. everybody else is like, I just got another blizzard. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. She's going to sneeze. Ah! Woo! Okay. I, I have an idea. Tell me. Wait, you have an idea? Yeah. I'm not, not... You're like Where's getting Harry? too excited. That is a good question. He he was a little bit needy last night. Was he? Well, he woke me up cuz like he was sleeping in between the two of us. Uh oh, she's going to sneeze again. It's cuz the sun's coming out. Yeah. Uh he was sleeping in between us and then he I don't know, maybe he got cold or something. So he got up. He left and we always or at least I always hear him when he leaves the room because we have a cat door, but he always hits his back on the top of the cat door. <laughs> okay, what was your idea? Well, first, I don't know where Harry is, but he was neat. Like, he would crawl under the covers. Mm -hmm. Crawl up and snuggle for a minute. And mm -hmm. then, oh, I gotta go. I gotta go. And he and runs he dashes out. dashes out. And he comes back. Anyways. My idea is, I think, I think I'm ready to do a gallery wall Are on you? this wall. Yeah, it's just such a big wall and that painting in the middle of like as I'm looking at it in the background It's just like it, it's, it looks fine, but I think a gallery wall would look nice. Um, can we take a break for a minute? Oh, you gotta go poop? Peter! <laughs> Nothing happened. She's back and look who Whose ears were ringing because we were talking about Hi, Hi man Good morning Good morning <laughs> Good morning, bud bud. You see our other bud bud? Yep. Hold on. He's just so picturesque. Oh, oh, cat stretch. Oh, oh I interrupted it. Oh, there's a cat yawn. And I have an itch. Okay. Let me show you the other buddy. Hi, buddy. Happy Saturday morning. Happy Saturday morning, stretch. Good stretch. Oh, oh you're such oh. a pretty poodle. Are you a pretty poodle? Don't call me pretty. You're a pretty human. I thought you were going to call me a pretty poodle. No, you're a pretty human. Teach a boy. Hi, Bubba. Okay, so we established our goals for fall. <sighs> Most of mine have to do with eating things. Mm -hmm. Soup. Soup. Is mm -hmm. another goal? Yep. We are not buying real pumpkins. We've decided. Possibly gourds, but probably not even. We do. We are enjoying our Target dollar section pumpkins. They're pretty great. Yeah. Because they're not real. We... It it was just last year. Why, I we got burned last year well, when they rotted. Yeah, and we bought them like this week last year. I saw okay. I saw it in the vlog. Okay. And like, that seems late enough in the season, but they they rotted. They rotted real yeah. bad. They rotted real bad. Um, we need to paint the corner cabinet for the baby's room. Yes, the other day Mary started taping off the inside of the cabinet. I realize we want to leave the inside just plain white mm -hmm. and I didn't get too far but I got the taping done well that's great and it's not gonna take long to paint it's a tiny little cabinet so we're gonna paint it the same olive grove chalk paint we Mag like, magnolia chalk paint. 
We got it at Ollie's, which is like a discount store. Mm -hmm. And they had this green paint and we were like, cool, let's get it. It's beautiful. I'm sure there's going to be some sort of free piece of furniture on the side of the road someday that we'll need to paint green. And that was before we knew that we were starting the adoption journey and getting a room ready for a child. And painting all the furniture that color. Yeah, so it's, Super it's fun exciting. to pull that out and have that in our cabinet. Yeah. I, <coughs> I think I doing the baby room has inspired me a little bit to our the roots of our marriage of getting stuff on craigslist and then redoing it mm -hmm. i recently was recommended a youtube video of like a youtube channel where that's what they do they like get free furniture that like looks really outdated and then they refinish it or repaint it kind of like i did with my desk yeah uh like it putrid orange Ethan Allen desk that I just made refinished and it's gorgeous I love it um so I was kind of inspired like maybe maybe we should do this more I'm just I, saying okay so we, in could that... we could flip furniture just for fun so we could leave right now since it's Saturday morning and look for a yard sale and try to find furniture I guess we could you know <laughs> Thanks for joining us on Saturday Morning Chat with Peter and Mary. And as always, we'll see you tomorrow. Cheers! Cheers. Good night, Piddle Noodle. You want to go for a walk? Oh, you want to go for a walk? <laughs> I knew you did.